I would like to ask you a few questions. Is that okay? Only if it doesn't take long. I have a lot to do. I'll be brief. What happened here? Why is everything destroyed? Things can break quickly. Everything can break quickly. How long ago did the power plant accident happen? I don't know. There was no power plant here. Just the library. That's a lot of questions. Just leave me alone, okay? But it's important. How did you survive the catastrophe? How do you mean? You must have noticed the climate change. I don't know. I don't like you. I have to ask these questions. Are there any other survivors? You said you have friends here. Many friends, yes. Uh, they aren't here right now. A pity. Uh, I would have liked to introduce you. You could have cooked for them. Too many questions. Much too many questions. Tell about my life again. I don't like that. Okay, that's all. Fine. I'm going to search for the tapes. Good day. Sean, Rattol, please start the inquiry. I am looking for an artifact that starts with the ID 21108321 Autocomplete resulted in three matches. One, the manuscript to Antima Day Shop by Ray Plemite, 21108321012. Two, a Ninan Opus Lux CSLR camera. 2110-8321-0089-3 Video material on The Indes Catastrophe 2110-8321-0091 Do you want to order one of these objects? I need the video. ID 2110-8321-0091 One moment please. Error, error, error. Not you too. What's wrong now? There seems to be a problem with your order. The container seems to be damaged or non-accessible. Objects with a similar ID are in the immediate storage area. 1. The Manuscript to Antima Day Shop by Ray Plemeet. 2110-8321-0012. 2. A Ninan Opus Lux CSLR Camera. 2110 Eight three two one zero zero eight nine. If there's not another way, I'll take the camera. Executing. Please wait. Okay, I'll set the auto timer to one minute. I must hurry now. I am done with the artifact. Good day, Sean Rattle. I'll take the camera. Executing. Please wait. Just a second. Ah, there it is. That must be the videotape over there to the right. And I can make out something else. A box with an ID. I am done with the artifact. Good day, Sean. Ra I want the artifact with the number 3476-8970-9987. The container with the ID 3476-8970-9987. Is empty. Do you want this artifact anyway? Yes. It fits. Can you ask?
ask Quickie to send the box back, please? My friends wouldn't like that very much. Please, as a favor to me. I will even cook something for you and your friends. You would do that? We are hungry very often. Sure. Scout's honor. Okay, let me know. You must call back this box in ten minutes. Okay. Thanks. You're a great help. You can send me down now. Okay. Quickie, send her down. A videotape on the power plant accident and one on... on the climate conference. I don't care what Salvador says. I say we must talk to the people. He'll realize that I'm right. So, I got inside the box and waited. I don't remember for how long. Ten minutes? Half an hour? Nothing happened. Your friend left you hanging in there. He probably didn't like you telling him how to live his life. Whatever. He had betrayed me. Hello? Time Travel Control Center? Come in, please! Gwadi? Naomi? This is Faye! Can you hear me? Abort mission! Lost. We have... Lost. Echoes from the others. Hmm? Ben Svensson is our safe. Ben Svensson? I never said that. Hello? Hello? Who's speaking? Make some sense. What? I said make some sense. And stop cackling like a chicken. Where are you anyway? Why are you on? Delvin repaired our radio. We can contact each other now whenever something new comes up. Something relevant. Something important. Something that helps the mission. Hysterical babbling is not on that list. Does the name Ben Svensson ring a bell? Svensson. That should ring every kind of bell. Even for you. He is the one who's been supplying us with energy for centuries. That's it! Yeah. Who would have guessed there was a connection between him and the Svensson generator, right? No, I mean, that's it! I have a plan! I know how we can prevent the catastrophe! That's all well and good, but we can't do anything without the tape. I've got the tape. I've even got two tapes. One is about the catastrophe, and, and that's the even more interesting one, a recording of the climate conference a week earlier. Then what are you waiting for? Bring it to me! I can't. I'm trapped. Just great. Where? In the archive. A, a friend was supposed to get me back out, but I'm still waiting. A friend? Just stay where you are. Over and out. Nice box. I hope they don't produce you in quantities now. Thanks for your help. You said you got the tape? There you are. Good job. And here's the second one. Okay, about the plan. We travel to the climate conference and tell the people there about the Svensson generator. After that, they'll shut down the power plant and poof! The climate catastrophe will never have happened. Where? Where is my friend? He refused to cooperate. I had to minimize the risk. Did you? Yes, and here. You can keep the video of the conference. I don't intend to sacrifice the mission for some diplomatic mumbo-jumbo. The power plant will be our target. What? Give me back the tape right now. If we travel to the power plant, even more people will die. 
We will go to the conference. It would be in your best interest, too. Now you made me curious. We don't know anything about the time we are traveling to. Maybe everything is completely different from what we are seeing on the tapes. If we traveled to the conference, we would have a week to find out more about the reasons behind the catastrophe. Hmm, good point. Continue. If we don't manage to save the power plant on site, the mission fails. If we try everything to prevent the accident beforehand, it will increase our chance of success. Makes sense. Anything else? We must find a long-term solution. Even if we save this one power plant, another one will explode somewhere else. Forcing humans to change won't work. We must convince them to change. We'll see about that. Was that all? That's still not enough for you? All right, I'll let you go to the conference. It's the better choice. You proved your intelligence and skill today. You altered the drill on your own and repaired an alien terminal. I'm sure you won't have a problem getting the second time capsule up and running again. What? In case you haven't noticed, there's only room for two in our capsule. And I decided to take the mechanic with me. You want to leave me here? Yes. And one more thing. We can't avoid violence. People who have to die, will die. Thank you for your dedication, Faye. Farewell. Wait! Since you are here with me now, I guess you managed to repair the second capsule. No. I tampered with theirs. You can't just leave me here. Delvin! I'm sorry, Faye, but I... Um... Delvin is more important than you are. He will ask you to kill people! Faye, please, I must not make a mistake now. The video is in place. The time jump will begin immediately. I can't do anything about it anymore. But maybe I can. Hey, please put the tape back where it was. But... I'm just following Salvador's orders. <sighs> I switched the tapes when no one was looking. Okay, all's ready. Time jump initiated. Pulsar on maximum power. Target coordinates logged in. Quantum signature of the video. Something is wrong. My god! Abort time jump. Too late. The time drift will tear us apart if I don't readjust immediately. Faye, I'm gonna kill you! You switched the videos, didn't you? Faye, get in Salvador's capsule. I'll try to save what I can. Okay, keep cool. The target isn't the power plant anymore, but the conference... One week earlier. On March 21. No, wait. On March 20. And the year... The year... Oh, God! What did Salvador say? I hope I got it right. The second time jump was different from the first one. The pain was excruciating. But I made it. With your help, we might be able to give mankind a second chance. Was all this Barney's idea? I don't want to be a spoil sport, but right now I am... I'm not joking, Svensson. You must help me save the world. Get out. Get out of my life. Did... Did you listen to a word I said? Without your help, I can't... Oh, you can. And yes, I did listen. And I did understand everything. And I turned the words around in my head. And now I want you to leave me damn well alone. Hey, dude. Don't chicken out on us.
There! He's tied up! Do you really think this is a good idea? He'll probably totally refuse to cooperate now. You mean, as opposed to before? What are these people? Some kind of eco-terrorists? And where am I?